How's it going, viewers of the internet? I just woke up about five minutes ago, it seems like. I'm missing something. So much better. So, as I was saying, in today's video, I have absolutely no plans whatsoever, but I just woke up five minutes ago. I'm shooting texts to all the homies, and uh, we're gonna make this day as exciting as possible. So, with that, let's enjoy this um, montage of me taking a shower and getting ready. So let's do it. I like to I like to love you every day. I like to love you. Alright, so from that artsy little time lapse you guys just saw of me getting ready, we are in the car of Brian Wynn and we are going somewhere. I don't know where we're going, but it's gonna be exciting. And him. Alright, so what are we doing? Sky zone. It's pretty self explanatory of where we are at right now. It's probably gonna be a title thumbnail, but uh. You're learning backflips. You got warmed up. Yeah. I think you're ready to attempt some flips. Okay. If you guys don't know who Brian is, he deadlifts, weightlifts, and he has like world records and stuff like that. And uh, we're getting him I'm on the basically trampoline. Basically, a big deal. He's, he's basically a big deal. Oh! <laughs> Yo! You got, you got to clean it up. Sketchy redo. Sick. We have to film on this blue carpet now. Oh! Oh, oh yeah. Oh, 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 hell yeah. Hell yeah. That's good, dude. Hell yeah. Nox. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Is that the first one ever? First one ever. First one ever. Fine. What the fuck? I'm scared. What a week. What a little. <laughs> Alright, we're now playing uh, dodgeball, and I can't throw, so I'm just going to be dodging the, the whole time, so should be interesting. I, I was explaining to the people, the, all the people in here, that I can't throw, yeah. so I'm just going to be dodging the whole time. Dude, I almost just lost my hat. <laughs> oh. Yo, one bite it. Huh? I said one bite it. Say so one. You won't. Oh. Did you know that George Washington was the first person to invent instant coffee? So, it's been quite a while since I've actually done a vlog. I've updated you guys on what's been happening in my life and how the progress with my shoulders doing. And you know, just all that vlog stuff that a lot of people like to talk about. So I'm gonna keep this short, simple, and sweet. My shoulder, for the most part, is doing good. I know I've been going to the trampoline park, I've been going to skate parks, riding scooters, and I've been doing all this stuff lately. And a lot of people are tending to believe that I'm all set to go. I'm good to ride my bike, and that is not the case. Well. Maybe it is the case a little bit. So, I'm able to ride my bike, I'm able to go out and pedal, but I can't do tricks yet. I can do little stuff and I can do, you know, maybe like a wheelie here or there, but I can't just go out and just huck a tail whip immediately. And I can't go ride as of right now because the weather near my area sucks. I just want to update you guys really quickly, like how, how good my range of motion is. Like, 
I could go all the way up here. About three weeks ago, I was able to do it like right here, maybe here, but right now I'm almost fully extending it. Still a little, still a little sore, I'm not gonna lie. And uh, as of like right here, reaching across to touch my other shoulder, hurts a little bit, it's a little stretching. But oh my God, I cannot go under right here. Right here, whew, that's, that's a killer. And I cannot go behind my back whatsoever. Like, like that's it. So, it's, it's a weird experience, it's a weird feeling not being able to use your arm to the fullest extent, but it's getting there guys. And I'm working so, too hard, I'm working too hard to get back to the full normal Ryan Needle to be able to ride the bike again. So growing up as a child, I was, into outdoor activities. I didn't like staying inside playing games for the most part, although I did at like night times every single night. I went outside every single day and I tried making the best of it. And the other day I got back with a few childhood buddies and I played airsoft and I, I, got, I got drilled at, like all over my body and it, it was really fun. And it makes me remember the times I had as a child and it makes me wanna go actually go do all those times again where I went go fishing every day camping and I had tons of weird outdoor adventure fun and the reason why I mention this is just because this channel is a BMX channel but I also want to incorporate some of those videos into it I'm not saying like I'm gonna go out and I'm going to just do fishing videos I'm just gonna go out and do this although I am a giant fisherman as much as I'd love to do that I'm I'm BMX has my heart what I'm trying to say is I want to incorporate BMX into all these things so like I want to do a day and I want to make days in the near future where I do everything. Ride BMX, paintball, and do all this other stuff. I'm not going to become like those other YouTubers who like, let's say they go pick up a hobby like cars or scootering and stuff like that or, you know, gaming and they post just gaming videos and then they post BMX videos on the other hand. I want to post videos where it's everything in one because I think it'll make an enjoyable experience for everybody. So with this, that's pretty much where I want to go. That's the direction. And with everything that's updating so far, it's looking to be prime. My bike, on the other hand, is not looking so prime. I still have to get more parts, but I also have one more thing to mention off. I've literally been talking so much in the past three months of videos. I'm sick of hearing my voice, and I'm sure you guys are too. And I'm sick of just editing these videos of me talking, and I'm doing it right now, and I freaking hate it. All right, never mind, never mind, never mind. Here's what I'm trying to say. I am buying another bike, but here's the scoop. It's from my ex-boss who happened to own a bike park and bike shop. So as you can already tell, he probably has tons of bikes and tons of good stuff and tons of bike parts. And basically all the parts are brand new because he was able to build so many bikes, but he wasn't really able to ride them. He wasn't really able to put them to abuse and he didn't really get the time and effort to really enjoy these bikes. So he was selling them and I was fortunate enough to get a really good deal on one of the bikes. The bike is the FBM Hardway 21 inch and it has tons of good stuff. I'm getting it without the wheels because the wheels are profile Rasta wheels and why, why would I even want to ride those? So I just told him to keep those because they have no use. So for the most part, I'm getting that bike and I'm going to be putting those parts on my bike and the parts that are on my bike, I'm going to be putting them on those bike and basically, I'm just gonna have another bike. And as much as I'd love to listen to the comments and say like, oh dude, just give away that whole entire bike, you're gonna have it for no reason. As much as I'd love to, I give away way too much stuff on this channel as is. I, I don't wanna have this channel just give away, give away, give away, give away. I just had a giveaway like last month. So, as much as I'd love to, and as much as I would appreciate you guys to get all these parts, and I'd love to pretty much give you guys all these parts, I can't do that because shipping is just crazy expensive. To ship a frame probably to the UK would be like 60, $70 and the, all the other parts, Jesus Christ. So <laughs> what I'm trying to say is that I'm probably going to be selling all those parts for a really incredibly low price. So if you guys are interested in any of these parts that I'm going to get in the future, just shoot me an email. I will give it to you for pretty cheap, really cheap actually. So on this part, I just want you guys to also know that I appreciate every single one of you guys for subscribing to the channel. Thank you guys so very much for watching this video. It's all out of whack. I just needed to get a vlog out of me talking and I hate talking so much, but 
Thank you guys so very much for watching this video. I'll see you guys in the next video. Share with your friends, share with the homies, share with the dog, share with the cat, share with your friend, share with your friends. Hot mom, as always, support your boy. Buy a bike life beanie or a needle media dad hat. Love you guys. Deuces.